The Enforcer, Solo Sokoa. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing the bloodline from Las Vegas, Nevada. Weighing in at 250 pounds, Solo Sokoa. A man of very few words, Solo prefers to let his fists do all the talking. You talk about intimidation factor. Solo has this entire arena feeling uneasy right now. Nothing but grim determination on the face of Sokoa. Well, it doesn't take a psychic to know what he has in mind tonight. Things are about to get good. And his opponent from the land of the rising sun, weighing in at 230 pounds, Mars! The WWE Universe has been counting the days, hours, and minutes for this match to start, and the countdown is almost over. This guy is in for an all-out street fight against the toughest enforcer in WWE, Solo Sokoa. Members of Solo Sokoa's family refer to him as the Enforcer. It's a title that aptly describes his demeanor, which is equal parts stoic and violent. Solo seems almost completely emotionless at times. Even while he's in the middle of tearing apart an opponent, his grim expression never changes. He's truly merciless. Yeah, no question that when it comes to in-ring action, Solo Sokoa is all business. And he's taking on someone who acts like he has nothing to lose. I don't care who you are, taking on an opponent with that mindset is always dangerous. Flawless takedown. Oof. Insult to injury. Ouch. If you're a bruiser like Solo Sokoa, the path to victory seems pretty clear to me. You just have to focus on doing what you do best, and that's beating people up. The more ruthless your attacks, the better. Pretty straightforward advice, Corey. That's been a recipe. Oh, wait a second. Maybe not. Roll up. Raises the shoulder before the one count. Wow. Not the position you want to be in right now. The oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Oh my goodness! Ah, what a smash! That is just insulting. This match grinded him down a little. Agonizing. He was waiting for him to make his move. That 
That's using your head. Sokoa seems to be executing his game plan. Solo just doing what he does best, beating people up with utterly ruthless attacks. And a seat shoulders down. No, he kicks out. It'll take more than that to hold him down. Good defense. Big, big back body drop. What elevation. Agonizing. Drops the leg. And now the pressure's mounting on him. Unrelenting attacks from Solo. You have solidified your name as a top athlete when you're able to pull off that move. Kick. Watch out. Course group plancha. Pinpoint precision right on target. Just breaking down the opponent. And Chikawa's bad mood could only turn worse after that. Oh, God. He fends off the attack. What a burning lariat. And he tosses him back in now. Oh. We've got the ropes to our first. Showing their athleticism, ducking out of the way multiple times. Out of a little head scissor action. Boom! And a drop kick. What's he gonna do to Solo? Some slow kick! That's gonna keep Sokoa down. Cover! Two! He kicked out at two. I thought for sure this thing was wrapped up. Well, stay in your seat. Looks like we've got a ways to go yet. And it's gonna take composure now. Could just need one more big move. Sokoa hits the spinning Solo. That's gotta be it. Obviously still has some fight left. Countered into a jawbreaker. Enable the counter. Seeing an answer for every move attempted. Head scissor. The WWE Universe is pouring more fuel on his fire right now. Torturous focus on the leg, punishing the leg. He's on his heels a bit now. Not a bad place to be in, but the longer this goes, the more trouble a superstar exposes himself to. And an impactful display of offense we just witnessed there. Looking for a little bit of high risk here, it seems. He's getting up, but there's danger in front of him. From the top! Kick connects from the top. Carefully measuring their opponent. Some slow kick. Can he shut the door on this one? The cover. And a kick out. No one saw that coming. How close was that? That was about as close as it could get without it all being over for him. I can't tell if it's anger in the eyes of the fact that he hasn't finished this or if it's disbelief that his opponent is still in this. That Rearing way back. Samoan spike. That's one for Sakawa for. Oh, shoulder up before three. You gotta be kidding me. Surviving that maneuver is absolutely amazing. I thought it was over. The WWE Universe thought it was over. But you gotta do a little more to finally finish this. Delivering nasty stops. Not so fast. Terry Kimrata. Good grief. He's going to the pin. This could be it. Into the pay window. To the top rope. Solo getting out of harm's way. Vicious, downright savage club right there. And he keeps his focus on an attack to that area. Vice-like grip on the trapezius muscle. This is terribly painful. Sokoa is focused on finishing this. Oh, I 
winding up. Samoa Spike. Solo can end this now. And picks up a monumental victory. Here is your winner, Solo Sokoa. Solo Sokoa securing the victory here. Solo proving that all it takes for victory is pure, unbridled aggression.